Amazon wants to deliver goods via drone by 2015. More like Amazon Prime Directive, am I right? That was bad, I'm sorry. Anthony here for D News, and a video released last night by Amazon shows their plans to have smaller items delivered locally within 30 minutes by autonomous quadcopters. In an interview with 60 Minutes, Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos says that he expects to be able to implement Amazon Prime Air as early as 2015. In as little as a year, we could be watching drones whizzing through the air, bringing people off-brand lightning cables and things they're too lazy to run to Target for. The future! We've talked a bit about drones being used for delivery recently. Some organizations are planning to use them to drop medicine and other supplies in developing nations. Australian company Zucal is looking to use them to deliver textbooks on demand. But is this really around the corner for a company as large as Amazon? Well, there are a lot of technical and regulatory problems to be solved before something like Prime Air can get off the ground. Currently in the US, anything flying under 400 feet and in an operator's line of sight is considered a model airplane for which you do not need a license. The FAA has been reticent to release clearance or relax regulations enough to let a large number of unwatched drones into public airspace, saying that they have high crash rates and poor maneuvering. They also have a tendency to get stuck. The proximity sensors on most of them just aren't sensitive enough to see a tree branch quick enough not to snag themselves on it. And the FAA is worried about fast moving objects in the air, even low flying air craft in certain areas. If the drones can't sense trouble and avoid it quickly enough, they could cause a lot of damage. There's also a concern about civilian drones being hijacked wirelessly and flown to a different location, which the Department of Homeland Security did in a test this summer. Imagine someone hacking a drone and then landing your stuff in their yard. I'm not sure how easy that is, but you can bet it's something on Amazon and the FAA's mind. Then you've got simple human theft concerns. You see a drone flying, you knock it out of the air, you grab the stuff, or you see it landing on someone's porch and you snag a package before the homeowner comes out. I'm sure there'll be things like mobile alerts to let people know when their drone is coming, but then what about people gaming the system? Dude, I went outside, package just wasn't there. There's no delivery system to blame as the middleman, and so Amazon would be responsible. Tack that on to fears from the technocratic and the technophobic alike, and you have got the makings of something that could be in legislation for a long time. The Electronic Frontier Foundation is worried about drones as an invasion of privacy, the ACLU is worried about them as death robots, and the government is worried about their criminal usage. In Georgia, a drone was being used in an attempt to deliver cigarettes into a state prison. And while cigarettes are bad for you, I think it was more the spookiness of it flying right in there unnoticed that scared them. I'd love to believe that we'll see this by 2015, but I think there's more here to untangle than Amazon would like to think. This is no fly-by-night operation, and the debate just keeps droning on. It'll be a while before ideas like Prime Air pass through legislation with flying colors. I'm just saying it might be a flight of fancy on Bezos' part, and he should expect some turbulence along the way. Oh God, I can't stop, help me. I just want robots to bring me HDMI cables. What do you guys think? Will we see drone deliveries soon? Let me know and subscribe for more D-News. Flight pun.